Hey y'all, this is Brad with Get You In Shape. This is your tip of the week. Uh, one of the biggest things I get is I don't have time to cook a healthy breakfast, lunch, snack, whatever it is. So this is what we do, uh, what we suggest to you to get a quick healthy breakfast, snack, and the, the uh, lunches throughout the day. So I uh, just went to um, the grocery store. I got some eggs, protein, I got um, chicken, I got some tilapia. Um, and then some fruit. I mean, every time it's going to be different. We got some grapes, uh, got some plums, got some uh, some apples. And for vegetables, we got a bunch of leaves. We got broccoli. Um, just pretty much anything you can think of. The we got tomatoes here. We got some mushrooms. Uh, some other things I just got. Uh, we got chopped up almonds, regular almonds, uh, hummus. And then for some of the snacks that are on the go, I got some bars. Um, we got some of the Avocare meal replacement shakes with the shaker bottle. Um, so this is what I got to prepare myself. We'll come back to uh, you in a second and let, let me show you what I did to prepare it. You also are going to make sure you have some plastic containers. All right, it's been about 15 minutes. I did some preparing. First of all, it's good to have, I didn't mention I had some strawberries, some bell peppers, some other stuff, but whatever you like as far as healthy snacks, healthy foods to go in your salads, that's what you would put in. But a few things that, that I do, especially if you're eating on the run, um, I put it, everything in a big container and then put it whatever you want for that day you're going to put in you know, a Ziploc bag. So same thing, you got bell peppers, you put it in whatever you want for that day in a bag. So. You put this in the refrigerator, you get out in the morning, it takes two or three minutes to put all these in a Ziploc bag. Got tomatoes, um, chicken, marinate it for about 30 minutes. Put all 10, 12, however many pieces you buy for the week on this. It takes an hour to, to you know, 45 minutes to an hour to actually heat in the oven. The tilapia, usually I would use fish for a dinner, so I don't necessarily pre-cook it. Um, I get home, it's ready. Um, don't just put some seasoning on there. Eggs, again, you're going to be eating that as needed um, in the morning. So I don't pre-cook eggs, but you can pre-cook hard-boiled eggs um, as a quick snack or even a, 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 as a, a put in your meal or put in uh, your, uh, your, your um, salad. Uh, other things, um, again, I have meal replacement shakes in the bottle just in case I need a quick, convenient snack or even a meal sometimes and even some uh, some healthy bars. The avocados, you're just gonna cook, I'm, I usually just do that uh, in the morning. So if I uh, wanna put it, if I'm doing a salad to go or something, you would wanna do that in the morning just to make sure it's fresh. The other thing, broccoli. Again, put everything in one big thing. You may need a bigger one, and then that morning you put whatever you want. I actually did the broccoli, because I don't like broccoli raw. I put the hummus, so I would, Put, put a little another container of that. Same thing with almonds, just whatever you want for that snack, however much you need as far as your caloric intake. Bunch of grapes, same thing, just put a little bit enough for a snack or adding to your salad, whatever you decide to do. The plums, you just do, and then um, the shredded almonds. So really, I mean, it, it took me 15 minutes to do all that. I guess that's plenty for the whole meal, a uh, whole week. It, will, it does take a few minutes in the morning to do that. Uh, definitely suggest some type of cooler, so just throw it all in the cooler. Um, but again, number one, it's going to save you time throughout the week. You're not going out to lunch. Uh, you're not going to a uh, you know, fast food place to eat, spending money. Um, you're going to save money throughout this time, but the big thing is you're eating healthy, and it's going to help get results. So really encourage you to try this out. Blog, comment on the blog, what you've done before. Uh, to help with this, what, what are some suggestions you could do to help with um, the, the other boot campers that may be reading this uh, or other people on this blog. So for more tips and information, make sure you go to getyouinshape.com, hit the blog, and we look forward to seeing you soon.